I hold the power of the land. I am the most powerful assassin. Um, not anymore. There's a new assassin. Why well, challenge you to a duel? For honor. Fatality. We've been lucky enough to arrange a giveaway of this product and all you've got to do to enter is comment Assassin down in the comment section for your chance to win and the winner will be drawn on the 12th of February. Good luck and enjoy the review. Hello guys and welcome back to yet another review with us, the Review Bros. And guys, we're bringing you something seriously special today so you do need to stay tuned. Each and every segment will be important as you will need to decide whether this product is right for you or not. And it comes in the form of Assassin version 6 by Anarchy Labs. This is a big deal, guys. We can't wait to get into it. Is it going to be game over? Stay tuned and hit that subscribe button, like the video, and let us know if this is something you're interested in taking. Cheers, guys. That moves us swiftly into taste and mixability of the product. Now, it comes in two flavors the original pineapple mango is still available in assassin 6 and the flavor we're reviewing and the new flavor is firecracker pop which we can only assume is along the bomb pop lines it looks like they've done away with the strawberry kiwi one then oh yeah i forgot about that one <laughs> this one smells good straight out of the box come on flat scoop gets you serving we've already been very prudent in advance and weighed that out so oh well, that's good stuff <laughs> Yeah, 16.8 grams is the serving, so yes, it is a heavy scoop for a stimulant stacked pre. Yeah. Let's do it. That's pretty good mixability right there, guys. In fact, very good. Not the most aesthetically pleasing liquid, but hey, who cares about that sort of thing? It looks like a Coke milkshake, that sort of colouring. Yeah, good stuff, guys. That's not bad at all. Let's get into it. Oh, it's got that pop. Power. Why a cracker pop? Damn, that is good. Mm. They've upped their game on Flavor Town. Yeah, it's so much better. Yeah. It does have a slight chalky consistency to it. Yeah, there's, there's Not still bad. a bit of a pre worky taste to it, but I'll tell you what, that bomb pop is really nice. Yeah, that is much better. Mm. It's I'm not the that. assassin we know, they've upgraded that taste so mm. much. Yeah, that's actually nice tasting. Mix brilliantly too. Mm. That makes a massive change, but we like it. You know, taste is the least important part, but I've got a score in mind, do you? Count to three, we'll drop it. Three, two, one, Eight nine out of, out of ten. ten. Oh. Oh. I'm happy to go out because it mixed fine, so. It is good stuff. That is so much better. I'm happy with that. Yeah, it tastes like a sour gummy. Yeah. That's kind of what it is. Sour gummy, bomb pop, that Little sort of range. range, so good stuff. Nine out of 10. Price guys, you know, is this expensive or not? Can we get you discount codes? All those questions will be answered. Right. US guys, go to apollonnutrition.com and we have a discount code RB15. That's a good start, right guys? How many servings? 20 serving tubs. So yes, it is a bit less, but we're gonna kind of say that, you know what, it is very versatile straight there, but yeah. Wait for that effects section. Servings of what you make it. Absolutely. So the code works on every product on that website, including this guy. So do grab it whilst you can. It drops this product down from $64.95 all the way down to $55.20. So it is still expensive. It actually comes in at $2.76 per serving at that full scoop. That lands on our consistent pricing scale at a high three out of 10. Just missing that four. Skirt. And that moves us into you UK guys, where are you gonna get this from? You'll be glad to know you can get hold of this powerful product via uniquehealthsupplements.co.uk. And yes, we do have another discount for you UK guys. Review Bros 15 for 15% 15 off. Yeah, great, great start guys. Knocking this tub down from 44 pounds and 99 pence all the way down to £38.24, Great British Sterling. 
working out to be one pound and 91 pence a serving four out of ten range on our consistent price and scale so those are two different scores for uk and us but we have come to an overall right Aaron? we have and that overall is that four out of ten because the uk was a high four the us was a high three so the two combined you know it's only fair really to land it on that four overall rounding up absolutely so good stuff you're going to be asking when you can get this it will be delivered next monday so bear that in mind. Honestly, guys, I highly recommend grabbing this while you can with that discount code. So use it, guys. Yeah. Four out of ten. It's label time, guys. The exciting part. Strap in. Yeah, exactly. Prepare yourself. One scoop is 16.8 grams. We've got vitamin B3, B6 and B12, all general health energy producing vitamins. And then we move into the first main ingredient in the pre-workout, L-citrine, at four grams. And I'd like to start off by saying that's a good, solid dose to start this label. Um, obviously, that's pure L-citrine. There's no malic acid there. Good stuff. It's going to be responsible for building nitric oxide up in the bloodstream, thus delivering some nasty skin-splitting pumps. That is a solid start. Absolutely. That moves us into beta alanine at 3.5 grams. Again, a hefty dose, guys. Over the clinical dosage, you're definitely not going to worry about going short here. It's going to be responsible for that beta tingle, almost itchy feeling that you get after taking a pre-workout that we really like because it gets us in the mood for the gym. Now, what I'll also say is once it's built up in your body, it helps with muscular endurance by buffering lactic acid, so it's going to reduce that burn after endurance sets. Go Good harder, stuff. Go harder for longer. Absolutely. <laughs> Moving into L-tyrosine at 1,500 milligrams. Again, a solid dose, guys, of the amino acid L-tyrosine that is responsible for focus and cognition and concentration. A hefty dose, guys. Nice. Moving into agmatine at one gram. This will pair up nicely with that L-citrulline dose at the top, giving you more skin splitting pumps and a gram again solid dose nice moving into lion's mane at one gram which is huge guys that is one of the biggest doses we've seen of, it, mm. of lion's mane obviously that is a nootropic ingredient it's a new one it's exciting revolutionary we've always had very good results with it it really does help with the focus in the gym really pushing you through each and every set so good stuff love it moving into dmae at 750 milligrams this will work in conjunction with that lion's mane by uh, boosting the brain activity um, it's been shown to raise acetylcholine levels in the brain thus um, you know building on those neuron connections so yeah focus for days you're going to be on the ball with this one and then we move into caffeine and hydrus oh, 500 milligrams yeah not much more can be said than that really the main stimulant in this and every pre-workout these days that is about five cups worth of coffee guys so if you need energy look no further this will deliver absolutely and we're just getting started then we move into B phenylethylamine, 500 milligrams. That's often abbreviated to the letters PEA, which is a hormone-like substance that occurs naturally in the body, um, which functions as a neurotransmitter. So again, with the lion's mane and the um, DMAE, it's gonna help with focus, concentration, you know, goal-directed behavior. It's a good ingredient to have. I'll say that the dosage on that is solid. And in fact, I think that's in line with Overtime by Anarchy Labs, another great product. So, you know, if focus is, is something you lack in the gym, this one will stop that. Yeah, and then we move into n phenylethyl dimethylamine, aka areodurensis, at 300 milligrams. Whoa, powerful central nervous stimulant, guys. This has been dubbed the natural um, version of DMHA. Obviously, it's not synthetic, so it's allowed. That's why they got rid of the, um, the DMHA in this product. But this will have similar effects in terms of stimulation. You know, getting the brain ramped up, getting the body ramped up. It'll work well with the caffeine dosage. It'll really get you moving, guys. Good stuff. Next up, we have grapeseed extract at 300 milligrams. And again, guys, I'll start by saying that's a great dose. I'll start by saying it's a jack of all trades ingredient. It really does have so many benefits to it. So we're going to pinpoint the most important ones as to why you would want it in a pre-workout. Now, the main one is it's an antioxidant, so it's a healthy ingredient. It's gonna help with blood flow. You know, it helps with uh, vasodilation. Um, it's gonna help with the pumps. It's gonna move the agmatine and the citrine around the body. It's good stuff. And it also reduces inflammation. So again, when you uh, tear down the muscle tissue, it's gonna help with recovery and repair. So yeah, an all round good ingredient that has so many other benefits as well and a good dose. Nice, the pumps would actually be pretty respectable with this. Mm. Moving into theocrine as T-cream 40%, and that is yielding 120 milligrams of caffeine, I believe. Yeah, that's right, guys. It's a smooth stimulant. It's gonna help with energy that's prolonged longer than the, um, the caffeine anhydrous on its own. You know, that's a good ingredient to have. It is, it is quite rare in pre-workout, so when you see it, I say snatch it up. Yeah, it always works well with caffeine. It's a lovely one. Keeps me awake for days. Then we move into decaffeine mellow. Yeah, you thought that was it. It's not, sorry guys. And that yields another 100 milligrams of caffeine. Whoa, this is topping up that caffeine dose to high levels, guys. I must warn you at this point, if you're new to pre-workouts, I recommend only starting with quarter scoop. Um, yeah. So, the uh, again, similar to the tear cream, it's a prolonged version of a stimulant, of the stimulant being caffeine, obviously. So that 500 milligrams of caffeine, when that does finally wear off, the decaffeine malate will take its place, so we shouldn't be seeing a crash on this product. Yeah, it should come down smoothly. And then we move into isopropanol snephrin at 60 milligrams. Interesting addition to this product, that is a powerful stimulant, guys. Obviously, snephrin itself is a stimulant and a fat burner. This one is a more bioavailable form, so the body will up take it much more effectively thus giving energy fat burning you know and the like it's a great ingredient 60 milligrams is a nice dose it's going to work very well with the urea and caffeine good stuff 
and very nice. Next up is hoarding at 50 milligrams, so I should synergize with that previous ingredient, right? Absolutely, another fat burner. Um, you know, it's a great, great ingredient. Obviously for barley, this is a powerful stimulant slash fat burner. It's gonna tie in nicely. Lovely energy, no guys, fat burning equals energy. Absolutely, metabolize those cells. Oh yeah, and then biocreen at five milligrams. Nice little tie off to this label. Obviously, um, you do have one more ingredient after, but this one, in order of size, will help with digestion of the product, which I do think is important, especially we're considering taking on a lot of different ingredients here. Good yeah. stuff. You want maximum uptake efficiency. And then rounding off the label with Rawlacy, 90% alpha, him buying 2.5 milligrams, very controversial. Absolutely, it's the love it or hate it Marmite ingredient of the supplement well. Now what I will say is 2.5 milligrams is the top end of what we would like to see, so I'm happy with that. What it is, is a powerful stimulant, a along with helping with blood flow and pumps, you know, powerful stuff guys. Obviously it's a lot more powerful than just your Himbeer on its own. 2.5, top end of what we like as mentioned. Good see, stuff. See how that comes together. We should be uh, off to the moon if that comes together. Absolutely, <laughs> and at this point I'd just like to reiterate, do not take this at full scoop if you're a beginner. Cheers guys. Please don't. Okay guys, we're gonna move into that most important part for you right now, the effects. How do we feel it in the gym? You know, let's compare it to some other products we know and love and that scored very well in previous reviews. Go on Craig, show them it. Assassin V5, so the most obvious difference is DMHA, no DMHA. Yes, yeah, so guys, this is obviously not as stimulant heavy. Well, we say that, the stimulants are still very powerful in this. However, this goes more down the nootropic route, the route of brain health, brain focus, you know, really dialing in on those gym sessions. Yeah, we've actually come to the conclusion that this new assassin is a hybrid of previous supplements from Apollo Nutrition. That have done extremely well, and that is the point we're trying to make. This is a productive pre-workout. What we've both concluded is, it is like this, go on. It is a third scoop hooligan for the pump and productivity. It is a third scoop assassin for the stim. The old one. And it's the two pills of overtime. The All tropic. three combined in the trio of power and productivity. That is what Assassin 6 brings to the table and it did so, so well. So, as we always do, we start off with the very instantaneous feelings we got from taking the pre-workout. Beta alanine is effective, guys. Yeah. Even though it comes in a 16.8 gram scoop. It surprised us. Yeah, it did. We weren't expecting to feel it all that much because like, there's a lot of other stims to digest, but you definitely had itchy town. Shortly after the beta alanine is, bang, the caffeine straight up the arse sending you off to the moon. It smacks you in the <laughs> face. But yeah. It smacks you in the face in such a way that it is productive in the gym. Mm. We did mention that we didn't feel happy on the pre-workout, but we did not feel angry on the pre-workout either. Yeah, it was more like a mind on the weights, aggressive towards the weights kind of thing, like <clears throat> Two words that spring to mind most effectively describing this product is productivity and aggression towards the gym session itself yeah. in focus terms. Those new tropics keep you on track in the gym productively. Now what we also have said, and this, you know, you can take this, the full scoop is on the absolute limit of what myself and Craig yeah, can handle. It like is any a more. strong product. Yeah, we can just about yield it, you know, control it and use it in the gym anymore and we'd be, we think we'd be flapping a bit off target. Absolutely. Three quarter scoop for myself and Craig is that sweet spot, which yeah. would prolong the servings of this product, making mm. it more cost efficient. But guys, have a play around with it. It's one of those very versatile products. Yeah, it's almost overdosed at full serve, so you can definitely still get clinical at three quarter scoop. Even half scoop to a degree. Yeah. Really, and at, really good. At the full scoop, it's like a rocket of stims that just never comes down. You're like, Ch -ch 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 -ch, and it, there's no real come down, is there? At all? Not at all. It's more of that hooligan feel, that productive pump, yeah. energy, focus, all of them combining together so, so well, and that really does. It's the best parts of. of different supplements, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. It's the uh, combination pre-workout, we like to call it. Yeah. And it really is game over on anyone who says it's not the absolute bomb. It's a very humbling pre-workout as well, because anyone who thinks, oh, pre-workouts don't work on me, I can take any, we took this and we were like, Jesus, like it hit us, we were woke. We yeah. got straight down the gym, smashed it. Like, you absolutely know you've taken a pre-workout. You do not miss that DMHA. No, you don't. That's the key point here. We've both agreed this feels stronger. Because of that stronger. nootropic element, it yeah. really puts the brain into overdrive, or over time, you can say. <laughs> and you become a hooligan. Yeah, it is <laughs> effective, guys. So, um, really good stuff. And it, it kind of gives us that no choice to give it that 
10 out of 10. Yeah, you probably guessed it, guys. Yeah, really, really, really good productive pre-workout. And um, what's worth saying as well, we both talked about, is saying. that Alpha Yahimba oh, is yes. right yes. on the line of what's nice anymore, and we do think it would be, you know, negative side effects, but they've just about sweet spotted that. Yeah, and we're quite sensitive to Alpha Yahimba, and we're not the biggest fans of it, but that yeah. 2.5 milligram dose doesn't give you that sweats, it doesn't give you that, you know, that dribbly, ill almost feeling. Yeah. You know, it stays productive. It's on that nice level of healthy yo. So that is something you need to bear in mind. Yeah. We do recommend grab this while you can because it's not gonna be around for long because people are gonna be snapping this up, there's no doubt. 100%. You know. But it is strong, it's really powerful. It's one of the strongest ones that I've honestly taken in a long, long time. Like, I was like, Jesus Christ, it's strong. Game over, 10 out of 10. Not for beginners. Pumps, you asked, and we'll tell. Pumps you get. They, yeah, it was surprising. Looking at the label, you know, there is a few things in there for pump, but with these higher stim ones, you kind of think, mm, it, you probably don't expect pumps, do you? It doesn't claim to give pumps, but we definitely got them, surprisingly. Well, the uh, citrulline dose, plus the acmatine dose, plus the caffeine delivery driving into the cell. Grape seed extract. Good stuff, the pumps are nasty. Yeah, do not dismiss it for pumps. Okay guys, that moves us swiftly and into the final section, the final verdict of the Assassin 6 pre-workout. Now, we loved it guys, we'll start off by saying that. But we're gonna run through the scores on the doors as we reviewed them. And we always start off with the taste and the mixability of the product, which we tried the new flavor, Firecracker Pop. Tell them, Craig. We gave it a nine out of 10. We was absolutely astonished by how much they'd upgraded their flavor game and it mixed fine as well. So deserving score. Very much so. Moving us into the price of the product. Now this obviously is discretion rule, but it has to stay along with our consistent pricing scale. Go on. We gave that a four out of 10. So slightly more expensive than your typical pre-workout, but this isn't your typical pre-workout, is it? Look at that damn label. No, you wouldn't pay pennies for a Ferrari, would you? Moving us swiftly on and into the absolute final bit of this final verdict, the effects, the important part of this review, um, the DMHA free pre-workout Assassin 6. What did we score it, Craig? We had no choice but to give it a 10 out of 10. It's a Stim Junkie's dream, but a productive Stim Junkie. A hybrid of previous successful products from Apollo Nutrition. Overtime Hooligan and Assassin 5, the combination is a cracker. Stim Nootropic Pump Productivity. Games. You could say it's a firecracker. <laughs> you definitely could. <laughs> Leaving us on a total score of 23 out of 30. So smashing it and only really dropping in the price segment. But like we say, you know, you pay for what you get in this scenario. Absolutely. Right? Cracking product, 23 out of 30. Hope you enjoyed this roller coaster of emotions review of Assassin version 6. It was a roller coaster and a roller coaster we loved. It kept on rising, guys. There wasn't a drop, however. No. You know, um, it was successful in all areas. Price is so discretional, guys. Use our discount codes while they last. Obviously, yeah. they are everlasting, but what I mean is stock is going to go flying off the shelves because yeah, of this. It really will. So recommend it while it's hot. Um, a massive thanks to Apollo Nutrition for sending us over the tubs to get reviewed for you guys. We enjoyed it a lot, as we have done with all the products. You know, they go above and beyond with the dosings and the ingredients. Oh, yeah. You can't argue with that label. Spare no expenses. Absolutely. Um, yeah, guys, get this. A massive thank you for watching along. Please do hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. And let us know what you think of this product, the label, and if you tried the previous Assassins. Yeah, ignore any naysayers of the product. There are paid sponsored people out there. It's very, very obvious. Yeah. Um, this is a cracker and we're always gonna stay 100% honest. If what you want is a strong pre-workout then yes. If you aren't scared of strong pre-workouts, half scoop. <laughs> exactly, there is always that versatility and at least it's transparent guys. They're not hiding anything. So that caffeine dose, some consider high. Studies show you can take a lot more safely. That's important to know. Yeah. And uh, as always guys, stay. Stimmed, as you will. I'm gonna get assassinated by this. Game over, naysayers. Shh.